Hey young Quinn, I wanted to talk today about arrow moccasins. A few years ago I started the blog and I put a few posts up about arrow moccasins, um, moccasin shoes, and it's one of my most popular posts. I get a lot of questions about it all the time. So I thought today we'd take a look via video at a, at a couple of different pairs I ordered. For the first pair of arrow moccasins that I ordered was this the 2i tie mock. I was shopping around for some moccasins. I found these made by Arrow Moccasins in Massachusetts, and they were some of the more affordable ones. And I think they're great. They've lasted me a really long time. The leather is very thick. It's a substantial shoe. Um, the hand stitching is fantastic. The double leather sole has been really great. Very durable, long lasting. Um, a super comfortable shoe. A little hot in the summer with it being all leather, but in the winter and in the spring and the fall, it's just been a great shoe. Super comfortable, easy to slip on and off, well worth having. The second pair I ordered was uh, ordered what they call the lace boot, and I wanted um, the crepe sole on it. This was a special custom order I had to call. I saw this on the internet and was fascinated by it. I had to call and special order this. Um, they put the crepe sole on. This is non-resolvable. Once you've gone with the crepe sole, you can't ever switch that back out. You can't put a new crepe sole on. You can't put a second leg of leather. Once you wear through this, this is done. And uh, I really thought this would be a great option because I thought it would be um, less slippery in the snow and um, better for a, a kind of a more formal or around town moccasin. And uh, I actually haven't found that to be quite as true as I thought it would be. I ended up ordering this, the lace boot with the double leather sole and this has turned out to be my favorite pair. I've really enjoyed this pair. I've had this for about four years now and I've even had them resold once. The soles, it's two layers of leather and as soon as you get a hole in the first layer you can start to see the second layer. They recommend you send them back in and they'll resole them, which they did. And it's just, I had them resold last winter. It's been a super shoe. You can see how thick the leather is and it's um, with the two layers of leather for the insole, the, the footbed kind of molds to your foot over time. becomes very comfortable. I've done a lot of hiking in the wilderness and in the woods and the rocks with these and they've really held up well. I was amazed that the first sole lasted me almost three years before I had to send them off and have them resold. Um, so again, if you're looking for an affordable, made in the USA, handmade moccasin, this is um, Arrow Moccasins, made in Massachusetts. Really just a great bomber shoe. Really enjoyed it. And I think that these double sole lace boots are about the best shoes I've ever owned. So I, I really like them. They've been great. They're not nearly as slippery as I thought they would be. So even though I, I thought the crepe sole would be less slippery, I've really, I've only in the very worst conditions have I ever slipped or felt like my traction was lacking in these. Very muddy, very snowy it has to be before I will choose not to wear these. For anything else, three seasons a year, this is the, the boot I wear in the outdoors, uh, day in and day out. Cool. Thanks.